Uh, speaking of acid, I uh, apologize for about two weekends ago. I was spilling nerds and Mountain Dew all over uh, the fundraiser. Uh, I felt kind of like a dick. Uh, I've left a lot of uh, bad impressions this semester. Uh, a lot of people uh, seem to think I'm some really, really insane person. And I mean, it's just like random people I don't know go up to me and just say like, Hey, I saw your set. Uh, are you going to make us pray again? Uh, so to uh, clear and purge my last, uh, this semester impression, uh, I put up a PowerPoint uh, of my life because uh, a, I love movies, B, I loved boyhood, and C, I don't have time to make a movie. So PowerPoints are the closest thing to movies. Uh, and so this is called My Lifehood by Carlos J. Carreras. Um, if you click on the sound icon and have fitting music for the PowerPoint, can you guys hear it? All right, so uh, that's me in, uh, in ninth grade. I got Fallout 3 for Christmas. Uh, you can see my brace of smiles is right here. Let's see. Uh, so you can go to the next slide. Uh, so I have two grandmas, uh, and I come from a matrilineal society, meaning my grandmas got married and uh, had uh, children together. Um, so this is like my grandma Edith, and that's my grandma Carmen. Uh, and when they got divorced, they subsequently created two different timelines. So you go to the next slide. Uh, so, okay, so this is, so now I leave two lives. So my mom in one timeline married a white guy, uh, and my mom in the second timeline married a black guy. Uh, so you can see this is my white family. Uh, it's me with the long hair. Uh, I don't like my white dad because uh, for a while he uh, insisted on like how guys in high school took showers after gym class. Uh, well, not totally said that was not true because you only have 45 minutes in gym class and so we're not going to spend 15 minutes taking a shower. Uh, then my friends were not allowed to come over because he would blast three days grace in the morning. Then he would wear a Darth Vader mask, get on top of us, and wake us up. Uh, and so that got really weird. Um, with my black dad, uh, I, can't, I couldn't find any pictures of my parents together. Uh, but we spent a lot of time in the courtrooms or in parties and stuff uh, with the lawyers. Uh, but it was cool because at the end of the day, then my dad would give us, my sister and I, a paycheck. Uh, so, so that was nice. Uh, so go to the next slide. Okay, so I get to lead the best of both worlds. In my first timeline, uh, I am Steven Spielberg's son. I look like Steven Spielberg when he was shooting Indiana Jones. And, uh, that looks like Vin Diesel, and that looks like Ellen Page. Uh, so I got to hang out a lot with like a bunch of celebrities in New York City. Um, in my second timeline, uh, I'm just really handsome. <laughs> look at that, look at those eyes. It just looks like, man, what the fuck's up with you? <laughs> uh, go on to the next slide. Uh, so I have two cats. Uh, one's called Dora. She's playing with her pet holiday uh, Christmas gift. Uh, my uh, cat Dora died. Uh, yeah. The last thing I said to her, shut up, bitch, because uh, she would wake me up in the mornings and uh, would keep meowing and meowing until I stood up and opened the door for her, just for her to come back into the room. So if I left it, it, it was just a terrible time. Uh, and that's my cat Spartacus who stabbed me in the eye. <laughs> Next slide. In conclusion, by revealing that I have two separate timelines to this timeline, creates a third timeline in which I am a cross-dressing robot uh, who is currently actually training for the next Pokemon context, uh, contest uh, because I can win a $1,000 scholarship if I become the master champion. 
So as I train on my Pokemon Omega Ruby game, I need you guys to text to my phone number which one of these three Pokemons I should uh, make into my party. That is an Armando, a Gardevoir, and a Salamence. Which one do you think looks stronger? Text my number 305-834-8970. Thank you.